Okay, so I got this deck, the Storyteller Tactics, so that you don't have to. And here is my honest review. Okay, so the cards are beautiful. They're on really nice cardstock. They're thick. You can't really bend them. They have really cute little um, cartoons. And I really enjoy how it's formatted. Like, it's very obvious. Like, if, you, if you're a skimmer, you can kind of skim what needs to happen. But the information on them is lean. Like, I could totally see using this if you're an experienced copywriter or writer and you're teaching a writing course. And you want something like this to be able to sh work with your, your students on. But for how it's being marketed, so it's being marketed to people who need to be better at storytelling for their business, for their job and all that stuff. Um, it really doesn't have enough to teach you how to be a good storyteller. Like it talks about storytelling terms and it gives you little graphs and stuff. But I'm sorry, if you're going to learn good storytelling, you need examples of good storytelling. This doesn't really give any examples. Like this card, uh, Stories That Sell, one of the examples is Rags to Riches. Okay, and this is the description for rags to riches. Try an optimistic story structure with your customer at its heart. Sorry, what? Like, I'm sorry, I think I paid like 60 something dollars for this and that's what you're telling me? For 60 bucks, I could have bought like seven books on how to do copywriting better. And some of the cards have like interesting questions on the back that could be used um, for content prompts for writing stuff for social media. But the thing that I really don't like about the deck is that like you pull one card, okay? Trust me, I'm an expert, that's what it says. And then it tells you like two other cards that you should go and check out to explain more. I'm sorry, but this deck has 56 cards in it. This is not the full deck. I just have a few out, but it has 56 cards. So I have one out and you want me to go comb through 55 other cards to find the two others. Mm, I don't know. That seems kind of annoying. And one of the reasons I bought this is because I really enjoyed the marketing video that they did for it, where the guy who created it, what's his name? I don't know. Um, he basically shows the whole stack of copywriting and writing books that he went through to be able to create this deck. But now I'm realizing that I fell for a marketing gimmick. Oh, well. So that's my honest review. I would recommend to save your money, go and buy some books on writing. If you want to know some resources to become a better writer and storyteller, then just let me know in the comments and I'm more than happy to give you some recommendations. Um, and when you do ask, tell me a little bit about your business and what kind of content you're trying to create because there's so many different resources. I don't want to send you like an idea of a resource to use that isn't going to help you. And if you want more content like this, then please like this video and hit follow.